Hang on, I'm gonna have to jaw grab him, so just take him easy. Beautiful. Very good. Good. Go. good fish, mate. Very nice. It'd be 63, 64. Very nice. Where would you hit it right at that log there? Right there. Cool. I right. did what I did last time when I got on, um, on that size. What's that? No, a little quick keep casting there. You'll still be here. He's a good one. Hmm. Oh, there's one under it. Oh, got him. <laughs> <laughs> Missed him. Missed him. We had a GoPro issue. We had a GoPro issue and it wouldn't turn on and off. So here you go. You hold that. Is it a nice one? It is. Young fella's fishing an unweighted paddle prawn. He'd be just on 60, 60 centimeters, this thing. So. But, um, yeah, he, he, I reckon it's the same one that hit me popper before, me fizzer, me bill's bug. And then the young fella's put in an unweighted paddle prawn in there and cracked him. Let me get this hook out of him. It's what they call a gamakatsu skipping hook. They're made out of a light gauge wire so that you, um, you, you can float your plastics. Weird out of his mouth. Yeah, I know. Well, I just spear him in nose first on that weed there. It's a pretty crocky spot, this one. I've seen good crocs here before, so I spear him out there. Oh, what the hell's <laughs> not spearing? Don't want to become a There we go. He's away. Look at that. Oh, is that you? Yep. <laughs> that's, a fish. that's a much better fish. Is it? That's a big one. Our timing is impeccable. Have a look out here. Shouldn't be long, it'll go. What was it? No, no what lure was it? Oh, okay. Looked like a good hit. Okay. It looked like a good hit. Oh, <laughs> you're kidding me. <laughs> That's a good fish. Yeah, he'd be 70 or something. How's that? We're just talking about how you were making it swim and it came up and ate it. <laughs> oh, dear. <laughs> That's funny. Well, you haven't got him on the bank yet. That's what I said, is it? Yeah, nice and steady. Now that croc's just there, so I want you to just get back from the edge there, okay? Steady, steady. Steady. Beautiful, solid fish, mate. We'll just re release him in a nice safe spot here. No, it doesn't matter. So we can see the bottom out here. <coughs> There's no threat there, so I'll just slide him straight out here, mate. Good to go. There's nothing wrong with them. Look at that. Hey. Look at that. Looks cool, eh? He's right there. He doesn't feel like a bad one. Hit the water, I got one twitch out of it. Oh yeah, he's a good one. <laughs> oh god, I went to go grab a net then. No. Nah. Yeah, he's a nice one, this one. Yeah, see if can get a jump shot on the camera. Don't get him eaten. No. no. That's what I'm worried about, that crop coming in. That's on that new Lumo with the uh, catch scent on it too. Really? Yep. He's got that around his gill raker, so I'll just take it easy for a second. 
if he takes it easy on me. I love this rod for this. You just don't pull hooks with it. He's getting up there, this fish, eh? Again, now he's turned the right way. It's off his gill raker now. You don't want to come in. He's got a bit of hurt. Oh, God. No, 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 not with 30 pound leader, buddy. That's a solid fish. Right. So that's the sort of thing we're after now. These are sort of, after the wet season, the uh, fish like this come back up after gorging themselves and stuff. So that's, that's a nice solid fish, that one. So we'll just get a couple of photos with the still frame and then we'll let him go. Jeez, that's in there. Oh wow. Look at that. Nice solid fish, isn't he? Let's have a look at this leader. You give, that's, that's only 30 pound yen you take a leader. Oh, feel that. Right, so this is uh freshwater and estuary catch scent, this one. So all you need to do is just get a little bit of gel on your finger like that. Here you go. And then just rub it on your fingers like that, and then rub it on your lure. It's gonna be harder for me because I'm using the surface. Like and some people, someone, look, some people believe that it's a, a bite inducer, like gets the fish to actually bite it, but other people believe that it's a, more of a, a masking agent to camouflage artificial smells like pe uh, petrol fumes, sunscreen, air guard, nicotine, all that. Holy dooly, that was an awesome hit, mate. <laughs> and I'll tell you what, he's followed that all the way from where that croc is. That was a bit, that was, that was yeah, I know, how's a meter fish, mate? Oh, don't you dare. Yeah, yep. The sound. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, that looked pretty cool. Hey, blow it. Can you make it now? This is a lot of different it's size fish. Yeah, there's a lot of different size fish in here at the moment, eh? Hey? What was that? Oh, wallaby. Some big arches there. Yeah. They're sitting in front of that debris. There's yeah. got to be a barrow sitting here. <laughs> oh, yes. <laughs> that was first yep. <laughs> so there's been a couple of changes in the, um, in the design of the paddle prawns and the texture a slightly bigger profile and the scent of uh, they've changed all that so if you uh, get a bit of this stuff here and just smear it on so that it um, adds that more I'm not real yeah, not a bad one just flick over there while I'm fighting there see if there's another one
Tangle. Not a bad one. Come on, let me go. Okay. There you go. 